Hi, welcome to Mushroom Workshop. Today we've got an easy thing to do. We're going to install a circuit breaker on our GCC system. We're installing this one right here. NCE version, EB1 circuit breaker. Um, we're running an MRC system though, but it is compatible. So it's pretty straightforward. Just two wires in, two wires out. And you can uh, do settings for what you want your uh, amperage at for it to kick on. It can go from 1.5 to 8 amps. Stock it is set at 1.5 amps. Uh, so we're going to install this uh, according to this thing. It goes that direction. And let me see here. Yes. DCC power goes in this way goes out that way. So, flippy dippy. Okay, here's our DCC system. This is our main bus area. Uh, our layout is so small, it's only a 12 by 8 room and I got one DCC train. I don't have anything else yet. So not too worried. So what we're going to do is we're just going to uh, clip it here, take this little bracket off, and put it in line. And put some Velcro in the back. And then this will go out to everything. Later on, I'll probably uh, redo it when I get another one or two of these, when I can afford them. And then I'll have the whole roundhouse system on one bus, the inner track on one bus, and the outer track on one bus. But with one train, no need. The other reason I want to put this in now is because of all my turnouts. Uh, my frogs ain't powered yet. Um, they're going to be hooked up to the uh, tortoise motion switches. And if I get one of those backwards, and it irks, I need a little protection. So let's get to installing this. First off, take this little clip out if I can. Or at least try. Might have to grab a hammer. But let me get these wires out first. No, they won't get hurt. Hammer, hammer, hammer. No hammer. Well, good luck with that. Okay. There we go. Just need a little tweak. It's coming out. There we go. Easy as pie. Look at it again. Make sure you get it the right way. We can go this direction with it. Let's peel off the backing be sure to uh, subscribe like comment love to hear from you um, other things coming up in our videos we will be installing a reverse uh, switch on the um, roundhouse the uh, turntable because it needs one. Don't need one anywhere else yet. Uh, another thing we're going to do is put in some other tortoise motion switches with the offset mount. Those would be interesting. And quite a few other things. This is taking too long. Oh. Do it off camera. Okay. Got the uh, backing off. So now we're going to put it on. Make sure we got the right direction. Okay, now we're going to probably clip it right here and pull the wires back. Later on when I do uh, put it in many different buses or uh, groups, whatever you want to call it, 
I'll replace this wire. And then I'll move these to a little thing over here. Have a nice little setup. Using the number 12 wire, and it fits in there just fine. So it can take a large diameter wire. Or we need to trim it back some. Yeah, it's a hair long. Trim it back some. Come on, Pearl. There we go. Get nice and tight. Yeah, it's got that coming out. Shorten this one a little bit more. Okay. Make sure you put this in the same order as the other side though. Black up top, right on bottom, or whatever colors you're using. There's a lot of other options on here. I'll show you here in a second. From what little I did read, you can program it too. Or you could just do it manually. For me, I think I'll just do it manually. And that's the last water. That's how easy it is to install. Double cinch down all these. Just make sure they don't pull out. More than enough. Okay. So now we got it installed. Uh, right here you have a, a reset button. 
manual reset. You can also wire it in here to wherever you need to do the reset. Um, it has a little LED in indicator that lets you know if there's a short or that it has power. You can also wire an LED in. It's already got a resistor built into this. You don't need to add a new one. And put that wherever you want. I might use that in the future. But for now, we're going to power this up and see if it turns on. And it indicates we got power. Blinking would be a short. So now we are going to test it. <laughs> 